What up, gang? This is Ken Zerk, Ken Zilligan, Zika Milligan, and Villain Villain Trilligan. We are back on Persona 5 Royal. Man, it's been a minute since I played. I started recording, um, Chorus Party Blood Drive, and I've been so locked on that. Um, you know, by this point, y'all already have some episodes of that up there. But I literally, I, I just beat Blood Drive yesterday, and now I, I, I'm free, so... I'm gonna go in and recall, I'm gonna go in and get back on this. What do you want, Magana? Okay. All we can do is wait. Oh yeah, okay. We have to wait for what's his name. We gotta wait for that strange mean guy to stop being strange and mean. Until then, let's hang out with Sojira. Yeah, question two. If y'all hear something in the background, I am washing clothes right now, so y'all might hear that. Oh yeah, my cleanup event is the day after tomorrow. My class has to go in the opposite direction of Eno Kashira Park. I'm kind of looking forward to it. That honor student is actually in my group. Huh? What, is she like your type or something? Either way, too bad. I hear honor students are exempt from the cleaning. Totally unfair, am I right? What? So am I alone on the team of upperclassmen then? This sucks. I want to just ditch now. I've had this in my head. I got a beautiful voice, guys. Boy, it sucks being inside this bag. I wish I could take Lady Yan out to do something. Shut up! Lady Yan don't want you. Takamamaki! Tamakamaki! We'll just have to wait for now. I guess now we wait. The suspense is seriously killing me. Um. I started training, so you should totally help me out if you have the time. I've got Ame no Uzume, I love her. Ino Kashira Park. Flourishing, natural beauty, great respite, get stressed, city life, couples off and right, boats in the pond. Alright. Hey, hold on. Takamamaki, you trying to try to ride boats with your boy? Oh, hold on! <laughs> Man, big open places like this are great. I think my train is gonna go super good today. So remember how I said before that I want to strengthen my heart? Well, I came up with a way to do it. How's that? Um. I think having a strong heart means you don't let anything get under your skin. So basically, I want you to say stuff to me and I'll try not to get phased by it. What kind of stuff? <laughs> We've already started. I won't let that hesitation shake me. What is she on about? Come on, hit me with your best shot. You're unique. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she don't understand. Like that's low key an insult. If someone looks you in your face and says you're unique, I'm taking I'm taking a fist to that. What do you mean unique? Um, that response was annoying. Uh huh. Uh huh. What else? Hold on, I love you. Hold on. Let's see if that shakes her. Wait. Hold on! Wait, what? That's cheating! You're disqualified! Huh? Wait, is this how the game was supposed to go? Oh well, on, on around two. Yes. Bring it on! Listen to me. I kind of feel like this won't make up for Sona stronger. <laughs> you finally get it. Hmm. Something's not right. Sorry. Got a call from my agency. Next shoot is really far. It's a notice saying to pay extra attention to the time and place they tell you. Apparently some models haven't been showing up at all lately. Then when asked why they didn't come, the models all said they heard there was a change in schedule. Sounds like shoots have been really hectic with all the scrambling they've had to do with the, for substitutes. Has that happened to you? No, I haven't missed a single shoot so far. It probably really confuses the staff to see a sub showing up too. Hopefully it doesn't happen to me. Though actually, my first modeling gig was as a sub. That was back when I was still in Finland. My parents didn't have enough models for their event. Oh, haven't I told you? My parents are both fashion designers who put on some seriously extravagant shows. They jump from country to country, so I only really see them for half a year. Maybe less these days. 
Are you lonely? Uh -uh. I'm used to it by now. It was rough when I was little tough. It was rough when I was little though. It was just me and our living caretaker. I didn't really have any friends. Wow, that got dark fast. Yeah. Honestly, when I'm modeling, it almost feels like I'm connecting with my parents somehow. It's a nice hobby to have, but I don't think I want to make a living out of it. After all, that's where Kamashita first spotted me, and that's how our class started those rumors. Besides, the Phantom Thieves are more important to me right now. Nobody can substitute me there. That's why I need to get stronger. Alright, she can do follow-up right. attacks now. When I was little, I used to watch this anime where the main villain was this female thief. She'd lose to the hero every time, but I always thought she was cool. She wasn't really a good person, per se. But she was beautiful, strong, sincere, and even sexy. She always did what she, whatever she wanted, and she always said whatever she wanted, did whatever she wanted. She knew what justice was for her. I wanted to grow up to be just like her someday. <laughs> Hope I'm getting closer now, if only just a little bit. You might literally beat her now. Hold on! I'm the Tokyo Taurus. I'm finna pull up with the thesaurus. So I can use new words and make you lose all your pubes. Hold on. And then I'm finna go and eat a Tyrannosaurus. Hey, it's me. Thanks for coming with me today. So after we met up, I tried doing some runway walks on the way home, like how a cool, sexy woman would walk. Then some girl who was watching me started to copy me and runway walked with me. She had to have seen me, right? Do you think she thought I was cool? Could be. It's almost enough to make me blush, kind of. To be honest, I feel kind of bad for her. She has no idea that the real me is a human disaster. Okay, that, that got dark fast. He nodded like, yeah, you are. Guess I still got a long way to go, but I'm not giving up. I made a decision that I'm going to get stronger, so I need to overcome any obstacles. Thanks for hearing me out. Okay, bye. Ah, you're back. Shut up. Oh, Lord. <sighs> Who is on my phone? Why are you sleeping with me, bro? Mishima's really hyped up about finding our next big target. But something telling me she's going to get himself in trouble. Maybe we should go with him. He said he was going to Harajuku. And I couldn't let on I couldn't let on know too. And I let on know too. Couldn't hurt, right? You respond wide right away to a confidence invitation without putting it on hold. Your relationship will deepen. If you immediately respond to a message, your schedule for that day will be filled. Let's go. It's so crowded, just like I expected. The perfect place to start our investigation. But I gotta say, I wasn't expecting all of you to come along. I had a photo shoot nearby, so I figured why not. But why Harakuju, Mishima? Well, Harakuju is this big cultural hub, right? People from all over the world come here. <laughs> so that means there might be all kinds of international villains walking around in broad daylight. I don't know if I get that logic. Uh, for example. Check that guy out. He's definitely suspicious. I mean, who wears long leather long... Who wears black leather long coat at this time of year? He's gotta be shady. And all those belts must be supplies so we can tie people up. Oh man, you think he's an escaped convict? No, I'm pretty sure that's just a goth style. But my phantom thief senses are tingling. Don't you think he's suspicious, Kinzil? You're, uh, tingling? Well, I mean, because I'm a phantom official on the website admin and... Look, that's not important. You know what I mean. If you think he's suspicious, then go talk to him. Huh, me? You're the one all hyped up about this investigation, right? So, hey, go up to the guy and say, Yo, Captain Trenchcoat! Sorry to bother you, but are you an escaped convict? What? You've got to be kidding me. He'd have that belt around my neck before I even finish talking. It's normal to see people dressed in unusual clothes here. Honestly, I think it's kind of cool. 
Like, they've got the confidence to wear whatever they want, you know? Like, nothing's gonna keep them from expressing their own style. Cool or not, they're definitely not letting anyone hold them back. What do you think about unique fashion like this, Kinzerk? I kinda wanna try it. Yeah. Well, really? I guess we could spend the day transforming you. I'm thinking heart-shaped glasses, dye your hair red and blue. I'll shoot you if you do that. And we'll get you a big, puffy, laminated coat. You want to make them wear the weirdest stuff you can find. I'll coordinate his wardrobe. We could go for a bad boy look. Or maybe something princely. You've got good potential, so this should be fun. Anyway, no more judging people by their appearance. If they're wearing what they want to wear, that's something to admire. Heck, I say they're being honest. That means they're honest. Not like people who seem nice on the outside have turned out to be terrible. I guess you're right. Lady Yon is absolutely right. Yeah. Meow, 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 meow. Now that I think about it, it's kind of Haraku Juki to walk around with a cat in the bag. True. He's like a really specialized fashion accessory. Meow. Meow, 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 meow. So, Mishima, I take you didn't actually have any leads here? No. Yeah, figures. Well, as long as we're here, let's have some fun. So let's get Kenzer dressed up. Oh, and Mishima, too. Maybe I could get rid of your weird anti Harajuku prejudice. Huh? Yeah, prejudice. Actually, I've got a hidden talent for fashion. This would be the perfect chance to discover it. Meow, 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 meow. All right, we can squeeze in a trip for the pet shop for Morgana. No! I'm not a pet! You know, Kenzil, sometimes it seems like your cat's really joining Gil in the conversation. Then let's get going, just follow me, I know a place. All right, let's go. It's all up to you, Miss Fashionista. She thinks she Junko in Oshima. Mira Inkoshira. Yusuke, any changes yet? How's Madarame? Nothing at the moment. He's still bedridden. Wait, you think this was too much for that old bastard's heart? There's no need to worry. His life does not appear to be in any danger. I hope we don't didn't F up on our first official mission. Can he talk at all? So far, all he has said to me is I'm sorry. I haven't been able to speak to him since, though. He is in no state to hold a conversation. For real? If he ends up taking legal action against us, our leader will be in big trouble. You are under probation, correct? That would be problematic. Hey, we're gonna be okay, aren't we? For sure. I'm a chef shifter! If Kenzer says so, it's gotta be true. I will contact all of you if any progress is made. Let's wait for the change of heart for now. Yeah, we'll be waiting for your updates, Yusuke. Well, then. Meow, 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 meow. Shut up! Don't freaking talk to me, bro. <laughs> Looks like you're doing well. Here, let me have a sip. Mm. This aroma and soft richness. You use Blue Mountain, huh? Let me explain. <laughs> let me explain. Jamaican Blue Mountain, okay. Goes rigorous inspection process. <sighs> the flavor profile is bland. You should practice more to bring out the roast full potential. Although I see you're preparing the cup the way I taught you, I'll acknowledge your hard work. That boy got a hunch in his bag. You look like a real barista sitting at the counter like that. It seems like you're following all the rules and instructions I gave you. Can't believe this kid in front of me is a troublemaker with a criminal record. Well, there's no need to have a lengthy conversation about this. Just keep up with your training. Opportunity to learn. You talk a lot, don't you? I I'm sorry I'm being so mean, but I'm 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 being impatient with the with the dialogue. But I'm really hungry right now, and I'm waiting for my grandma to be on the way home to start okay. cooking. We're supposed to be cooking our food together, but I'm starving right now. We're cleaning up today. It's further away than the school, right? Hurry up and get dressed so we won't be late. 
I'm, I'm not gonna lie. Kendrick was like, what is it, the braids? It is the braids. Like, my braids are really tight right now. Sorry, but I'm in a bit of a hurry. You go to Shujin, right? Ew! He sounds like a rapist. I heard things have been rough there lately. What with that violent incident. You want to go talk about it somewhere? Oh, no. Thank you for your concern. Oh, yeah, she look, she look ready. She might have kicked boy in the balls. However, I really am in a hurry, so if you'd excuse me. Come on, there's no need to be shy. Hey, hey, hey! Like I said. If you're busy, I'll put my number in your phone Ew. soon. Ew. Later. Sound like a plan? Hey! Hey! Kid Zerk! Take his heart! Stop it. Y'all gonna walk away? I cannot overlook this. What do you want? Hey, back up! I go to Shujin too. Huh? Uh. Yeah. You wanna talk to me about the incident? Huh? You wanna come for me? Yeah. What the? What are you getting so jumpy about? Like you're anything special. You're the opposite of special, nigga. If special was zero, my nigga, you negative 5,000. You should kill yourself, actually. I was finna say something about his hairline, but we got the same hairline. Thank you so much. I'm sorry for the trouble. No problemo. Your boy is superhero. Are you okay? Yes, I'm fine now. Fantastic. It was pretty scary though. Uh, uh um May I ask you something? Ask away. So, what made you step in to help me? Cuz I wanted to. That's it? Well, I apologize for asking something so strange. You're headed to the cleanup as well, right? The cleanup? <gasps> Look at the time! I'm so sorry, I haven't even thanked you properly yet. Oh no, I forgot my gym clothes at school. I'll see you at the cleanup soon. Did she just judge me for wanting to help her? <laughs> Hold on, I don't understand people, bro. These people is confusing. I, you asked me why I helped you and I said because I wanted to help you. Is that, is that strange at all? You see somebody like being harassed and you want to help them so you help them, that's strange? I'm, I'm confused, <laughs> I'm sorry. We can talk more then if you'd like. Pardon me. What a polite young lady. What took you so long? Did you really come here from home in your gym clothes? Sure did. It must be so nice to be a guy. Huh? Ain't it normal? And, uh, are you planning on doing this cleanup in that outfit? Yeah, like, ain't nothing stopping you from doing the same thing. Don't mess your clothes up. Of course not. I brought my gym clothes with me. I was gonna change in the bathroom, but now there's a huge line. Change right here. Hold on! No, no, don't do that. Oh, that makes sense. Sounds like it sucks to be a girl. It's such a nice just... day out that even the weather seems to be mocking us. Dude, could you try pushing your way into our conversation a little less awkwardly next time? I bet some Kichi Joji clean freak hung paper dolls all over and prayed for clear skies today. Hey. Ah, oh, this guy. Morning, everyone. How you doing, man? Huh? Are you here for the cleanup too, Doc? You got it. Uh, in those clothes? Oh, no. I'm in a difference. There you are, Dr. Maroki. We're going to start prepping soon. Prepping what? I'm part of the cooking crew. Hope you're looking forward to a solid meal. See you all later. Hmm. I can't remember if I brought any like starchy vegetables. More like Dr. Popular. 
Don't hate. Sure the phantom thieves will be even bigger someday. Don't hate Ryuji. Ryuji, whatever your name is. Good morning, Shujin Academy students and staff. Please pick up all trash located in the areas assigned to your group. Once the cleanup is completed, a lunch of miso soup with pork and vegetables will be served. Ooh, pork miso soup. So that's what Dr. Maruki's fan club is making. FYI, the school already assigned the groups at random. They're four people apiece, boys and girls mixed. Why do you care? Oh, really? Now that those announcements have been made, please break into your groups and head to your assigned areas. All right. Let's just get this over. I right see why they possible. said that. Because my, get out of here. my bad. I see why they said that. Makoto is probably gonna make it to where it's me, Ryo, Ryo, Ryuji, Tamakami, and her. So that she can grill us and investigate us. Come on. Watch me call it. Watch me call it. I'm the goat, so watch me call it. Hey, that guy? Yeah, him. Is he that transfer student? Yeah. You mean the one in all the crazy rumors? Y'all just talking! What if he hears us? I can hear you! Ugh. Anyone who just dumps a broken umbrella on the ground like this is human garbage. Oh, before you trash it, you have to make sure you separate the plastic parts from the metal frame. Separate it? How? Like this. Whoa, awesome! I had no idea you knew about that kind of stuff, Takamaki-san. I bet you'd make a wonderful Takamaki. wife. Takamaki, Takamaki, Takamaki. I keep messing it up. I keep messing up her name. Oh, nah. Sweet, a wallet. Anything in it? Hey, that's stealing! Yeah, shit ton. We go in splitsies on this? Wait, shouldn't we take that to a police box? What? How was that weird? Man, this park is trash. The way this was all done by kids. It's gotta be the work of some no good adults, too. Mashima, please get the grown up dick out your mouth. If you don't mind, may I have the cap on that bottle? Ah, she's pretty. Huh? Sure. Oh, are you a collector? Uh, not exactly. Recycling companies collect these and convert them into vials for vaccines. Uh huh. I didn't know that. Well, that sounds like an awesome way to bring more justice to the world. You cornball. I'm sorry, but I'm not sure I follow you. Even she found that corny, bro. Before I add taro to the pot, I have to rub them with salt to reduce the sliminess. Oh, you're an amazing chef. I do cook pretty often at home. Let me try this little technique here. Uh huh? What the? Why is the wind salty? Uh, sorry. Bro, thought bro was trying to be cool. So, after the soup's doled out, everyone's free to do whatever they want. Huh. Including getting the hell out of here. Oh, okay. Thank you for everything. I don't know the best way to put it, but that sure was a crappy time out there. Yeah, bro. Oh! How's it going, student called Yoshizawa? I finally found you. What's poppin'? I was trying to find you so I could thank you properly for this morning. So, where'd the other people in your group go? Uh, they dished me. Ah, I see. I'm in pretty much the same situation. A guy like me? Could never be me. If it's alright with you, why don't we eat our soup together? Sure. Great! Thanks for the food. I want to thank you again for this morning. 
That man was even more frightening than he might have appeared to you. So I truly appreciate what you did for me. Thank Don't worry about it. It was nothing. Sorry, but I'm not even finished. What? There's one more issue I need to address. I'm also so sorry for what happened the other day. What happened the other day? The run-in we had outside of the guidance office. Remember the discussion we just had? There are a number of students in this school you shouldn't get involved with. This one's at the top of the list. Oh, 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 the delinquent transfer student? Mr. Kamoshida had just told me about you a moment prior, so I sort of spoke without thinking there. I heard some of my classmates gossiping about you, too. Were you surprised? I was, but I haven't paid it any real mind. As you shouldn't, I'm a goat. I don't like gossip or rumors and the like. And I know this will sound strange since I just met you, but you don't seem like the kind of person they describe. She recognizes a goat when she sees a goat, come on. It'd be a different story if all those rumors were actually true, though. What were all the crimes I'd heard? Burglary, murder, and elephant tusk trafficking, was it? What? 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 That That's a first for me. It's absurd, isn't it? Elephant tusk trafficking? Not... <laughs> Rumors can't be trusted at all. How would I get my but hands on that? Everyone starts shaking in their boots whenever they hear your name. Hmm? You know what? It just hit me. I haven't introduced myself yet. I'm Ken Zerk, Ken Zill, Zika Mill, the villain, oh, villain trill. I'm sorry to make you go first. I apologize this was such a long time coming, but I hope we can get along well. I believe you already learned from our meeting at school that my- That ugly kid, ew! <laughs> that was so extra. That was so extra! Kasumi Yoshizawa. Got it just in time. Here you are. Don't let go of things you like, okay? Sorry, I didn't mean to run out on you like that. You dropped this. Huh? <laughs> I guess you sleuthed me out before I got to tell you. Well, you've cracked the case. I'm Kasumi Yoshizawa, a first year. You an athlete? Figured that out too, huh? Well, yes, I compete in gymnastics. It's not that difficult once you get the hang of it. Just a hop, skip, and a jump. Gymnastics, huh? Hey, don't you think some of those moves would be awfully useful? I was just thinking about how the Phantom Thieves need to get some sweeter moves too. Stop meowing! What's the matter, senpai? Wait, is there a cat somewhere around here? Can you teach me that stuff? Does that mean you're interested in gymnastics? Yeah! That makes me so happy. I'd be honored if you'd allow me. The only problem is... I have a favor to ask for myself as well. If you wouldn't mind. Let me know. Lately, I haven't been getting the results I want from my performances. And I'm worried that I'm overthinking things. So it would be wonderful if you could give me some advice whenever you have the time. <laughs> you want my advice? Are you sure? Are you positive about that? Sure I do. I'd love if you were willing to lend me an ear from time to time. I see. This sounds like a pretty sweet deal to me. What do you think? Hope I'm helpful to you. Thank you. Then we've cut a deal. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I've read in the reports that the Phantom Thieves' physical abilities are more acrobatic than the average person's. It seems you've gained an aptitude for specialty equipment as well. 
Wouldn't a natural conclusion to draw be that you were trained by an expert in that field? Nuh uh! Well, tell me the truth. Nuh uh! I am thou. Thou art I. Thou it shall be the. Talk a lot. Faith persona? Alright. Oh, why don't we exchange contact information? Huh? It shut down. Sorry, my smartphone's been acting up lately. <laughs> it's back! Okay, I'll contact you when I've got free time, if that's fine. Attention, Shujin Academy students. The cleanup event will be ending momentarily. Please do not discard your trash in the bins here. Instead, bring your waste to the predetermined location for disposal. After that, we will be officially releasing everyone for the day. Thank you all for your hard work. Well, the cleanup seems to be finished. We're already in our gym clothes. Would you care for some basic training before heading home? Let's start with some core exercises. Those are the foundation for staying in shape. Me and Kasumi had some, some training sessions. Mm. Finally home. Me and Kasumi got some training done. Hold on. Where have you been? Must have on the beat, hold the boat, and he rap, nook, he a free throat, man down. Call that ambulance, tell him breathe, bro. Nail a nigga to the cross, he walk around like teeth out. By the way, the exhibit's till the end of this week, huh? We did what we could, and now we wait for the results. Let's study. No way, man. Nope, that, that's one option, that's a definite no. School's enough for studying. Let's exercise, man. I want to get my knowledge up, though. Oh, yes. I'm not listening to all this. What's up with these jabroni ass niggas trying to see Compton? In the street, can hate me. Fuck them all in their mama. How many cops you really got? I'm just Wait, no! Wait, oh man, it's to Kimmy. I wanted to go to Mementos today, but it's to Kimmy. I can't turn her down. <sighs> okay, that's all for today. If you're feeling okay, you can go home now. Hello? Hello, Dr. Takemi's Clinic of Internal Medicine. What, again? That's, well, that ship's already sailed, so. <sighs> what a pain. You remember that girl from the other day, the chief of staff o Oyamada's patient? Her dad's been bringing her here to be treated, even though I referred them to another hospital. I even told them about the medical error I made. They trust you. I'm just a quack, though. Hmm. The medical error is well documented. Everyone in my field knows about it. I led the development of a new drug for an incurable illness called crawford Andes disease. Although I wasn't the one who administered the medicine, it was the cause of the error. With Crawford on days, certain cells indiscriminately attack other cells throughout the body. When it reaches the muscle, the patient slowly begins to die. There hasn't been much progress made on it, partly because there hasn't been many cases of it. I worked with a, pharmaceuti a pharma pharmaceutical company that had reached the final stage of production, though. But... One day I was suddenly removed from my position. That chief of staff, Oyamada, my superior at the time, took over the entire operation. He set you up. Ooh. Hold on, you think he's getting romantic? I don't know if he wanted the glory of developing a new drug or to become rich and famous, but he made careless mistakes and rushed competent and rushed completion so he could use it on a patient named Miwa. Miwa Chan had a reaction and lapsed into critical condition. The chief panicked and laid the blame on me. Meanwhile, her family resented me. No matter what I did, I couldn't change how they felt about me. Damn. I had no idea. That's fine. Well, that doesn't matter. 
the development of the medicine was suspended, so I had no reason to stay at that hospital. At least now I can keep working as a general practitioner on my own terms with my guinea pig. That's the new medicine I've been trying out on you. This version is in the final stage of testing. It searches for those cells that take the offensive and destroys them upon detection. That's why it's harmless for people who don't have the disease, probably. Uh, that's good. <laughs> you have a lot of faith in me. Thank you, my little guinea pig. Uh, hey. I need a bad bitch to call me that. You better not flake on me this late into the game. I mentioned closer to the finish line, but I need your help to reach it. In exchange, I can offer you medicine at a special price. I'm counting on you, guinea pig. Is it weird that my meat flinches a little bit every time she says that? All right. Hmm. Now, what should I do about that girl and her dad? Being mean and scaring them hasn't worked. Why am I playing with my dick right now? Stop. It's been a while since I've had to deal with this kind of nuisance. It's stressing me out. Oh, sorry. That's all I wanted to talk about. You can go home now. Takemi, I love you. Takemi, I love you. You doing okay, my little guinea pig? I just wanted to check up on you. Sorry for the long talk today. I wasn't planning on telling you all that. About Miwa? Yeah, you're the first person I've really shared all that with. But it was a good reminder. This is something I have to do. That's the plague. Thanks to you, the drug's development is progressing very smoothly. If there are no issues with this latest sample, I think we're right on the edge of finally finishing it. Oh, I got a patient. Maybe that girl and her dad came back. I have to go. See you later. Where is art showing off? An exhibit? Maybe not. Redo. Must surrealist. I don't know what that is. Paris Museum. I don't know what that is. Wall artwork. P O R. I don't know none of this. Oh, a gallery. Guys, I might be stupid. I don't look at art that much. Oh, well, you know, not the typical art. I, I, I typically just look at like um, drawings on Twitter. Like that's the type of art that I typically look at. So I don't know much about exhibits and, and the like. Hey. Shut up. Well, which do you want? You need to stop talking to me like that. People can get medicine whenever they want here in Japan. You're making me feel strange. Like oh, come on. That was a home run. Come on, bro. That's a home run. Yes. Right there. Oh. My issue. The timing yes. might be the issue. Oh, there we go. <laughs> that scared me. Employee posts nude chef selfie. Wild Duck Burger claims to have fired the employee in question. Can mm. can I see it? This persona? Is this what you such rude? Is this what you such rudeness? Is this what you want? This such rudeness. They comment. They comment on you and uh, on you leaving before they can finish talking. Vehicular manslaughter! Get, put your cock away. Put your cock away. That punch wasn't very lucky, now was it?
That was so hard it made my cock flinch. First of all, however, it looks like this one won't open without expanding upon that. You said you believe influence comes from people believing in us. Maybe this one would open too if we get more people to accept us. Y'all talk too much. All right, we just gotta, um, what you call it, do more stuff. How long have I been recording? Like an hour? Oh, man. Oh, mister. Yo. When you get flowers, bring them to me. I'll go ahead of you guys. Great. Well, this is neat. I've never seen these in my studies. They're the accumulated byproducts of rope cognition. Has a reach full potential. I won't do any damage, I promise. Good. <laughs> That's right. About those byproducts of warps cognition, the will seeds. Wanted to learn more about humans, so I went around to see if I could find any of these, and look, I actually did. I wonder why it was just laying around here. Maybe it fell from some other completely different place. Why well, are you collecting these so you can have it? I can change mementos for you in all sorts of ways. You want me to change mementos? Sure. Here we go. Just watch. I've learned all about this. You see, the cognition flowing through mementos. It's got these things that are similar to what you humans call pressure points. So, if I do this... <laughs> there. That should have changed it for you. Don't believe me? Just take a look for yourself. Excuse me again, sir. Ah, you're back. I assume you're all curious why I'm sending you an update just in case. Madarame is still bedridden, he hasn't spoken a single word. My apologies for not being able to provide anything more solid. Come on, it's not your fault, don't worry about it. It is June already, though. The exhibition will be ending soon. At least it looked like Madarame had a mental shutdown. But there's no point if you don't have a change in heart and call off that legal action bullshit. Was this how it was when you defeated Kamoshida? Pretty much. Yeah, Kamoshida was out of school for a while. Either way, there's no been no palpable progress. It appears only the target themselves can tell whether or not their heart has changed. It's a damn pain in the ass, but yeah. We just gotta hear from Madarame himself what the deal is. Yeah, there's nothing we can really do. Let's just try waiting a little longer. He better hurry the hell up. I should write something. Alright. That's the end of the episode, guys. If y'all enjoyed, like, subscribe, read a comment, and read a comment, type into the next one. I hate that this one is so short, but man, I'm just tired. I recorded like three hours of corpse party earlier today. So I guess I'm just a bit out of it. Let me focus on editing stuff, you feel me? You feel me? Tomorrow I'm finishing up corpse party. And then I'm gonna get on persona again. Ah! Peace out. I love you guys.